everyone. Frogman here. Uh, Maniac said that he wasn't going to make it. So, uh, you know, I, I would just say it might be best to sit here and maybe hang out with me a little while while I look at my eyeball, looking at me, looking at the eyeball. The frog's on my head. Frogman? What? Uh, did you start the strip video without me? Um, uh, maybe. Ah, uh, damn it, Frogman. Get out of here. Oh, shit. What's going on, everybody? <laughs> Maniac here with the Mage's Archive. How's it going? Yes. I'm sure you know what this means. Day before release. We're going to open Darkness Ablaze. Finally, it's here. And it's glorious glory. We're going to crack this open and who knows? Maybe this guy will show up and uh yeah that would be wonderful and amazing but yeah uh out of the boxes that i got in this one was probably the ugliest i know uh a lot of my fellow pokemon fans they they, they, they like a nice pretty booster box and because they may not open it i know i know some of you are thinking like what Buy a booster box, not open it. <clears throat> yes, but sealed collecting is, you know, very popular amongst all the TCG communities. Wow, this looks like really, really tight. I might have to actually like bust out some scissors for these packs. But yes, Darkness of Blaze is here. The excitement is now. And, uh, yeah. Did they, uh, did they move stuff around on me? Okay, nope, that's an energy. Okay, so that still works. Oh my god, we have something right off the get-go there. It peeked, it peeked its little, little head out. Just peeked it out. I seen it. I'm excited. The good times are about to come. Right out the gate with Eternatus V right off the bat. Very nice. I will very much enjoy that. One minor thing. I am only going to show maybe half of these. Because personally, I would like to use them. So I will go ahead and show that one off for you. I know, I, I usually show them all, but I have been uh, tooling around with the game a little bit more than, than, than usual. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll, we'll, sh we'll show a bunch off the first half and then some more off the second half. How about that? But uh, yeah, I uh, could really use some more packs, especially of the new set. But don't worry, there will be plenty more opportunity to get more codes on the channel I promise and for some reason these uh, cards are just uh, already trying to slide everywhere they're not even stacked very high yet huh they're not even stacked that high <clears throat> all right uh, we'll keep that one And do, 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 so far, some, uh, oh, we got a Piers. Piers is uh, showing her little self off, or his. It's hidden. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Piers is a he. And nope. Nothing great for that pack. Oh, maybe this one is uh, got some foreshadowing. Man, these packs are just really rough right now. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll show two, keep two. How about that? That way, hey, Rose. And... But yeah, um, nothing too crazy different from the set. Um, from 
Ooh, oh, that's a really nice reverse hollow rose tower. I mean, of course, you know, there there are some minor changes to some of the more basic Pokemon, and uh, but as always with with any new expansion set, the the big changes come with the secret and ultra rares. Here's a code for you. And the card that everybody's going to want. And for more than just the fact that it's, you know, a badass card, it's also got a ton of value attached to it. And that is the Charizard VMAX. Ooh, a little uh, Hollow Reverse, Hollow Rare Agron. Yes. Gloriousness there. Set that one into its separate little pile there. I'm gonna stick these up there as well. So that was that. Yeah. But overall, it's a uh, it's a good set. Uh, yeah, it's a showed one. Nothing. Um. Oh, a little Dedenne. That is an adorable Dedenne card. Absolutely adorable. But yeah, there's definitely uh, nothing about the set that would upset anyone or, you know, dictate that it's weaker than previous sets. It's, it's, it's just as strong, if not the strongest set currently based on the card list that I've seen. Um, it might be about the same. It might just be that whole new set feeling, you know, throwing me around. I don't know why I just did that. A little kaboo there. Oh, a turbo patch. That's pretty cool. I'll try not to go too crazy fast. I'm really liking the art, though, so far. Wow, I really like that Nicket, too. Really digging it. It's very nice. Even that uh, Volcrona is pretty awesome looking. Really liking the art. Not liking how these packs are though. These packs are just like. Um, oh yeah, I'm showing anyway. I know that was supposed to be a keep card supposed to keep that one but you know I just I just I just want to I want to share with you guys I want to share it all oh, look at that Marini like that art too very pleased definitely uh, some of the better art I have seen in Pokemon so far I like it a lot. Yeah, that's a keeper. All right, that one was a keeper. Ooh, I think there was a sneak of something there. I don't know if I just miss saw that. A hiding energy, Gothrita. I like that art too. It's very nice. I like Trike. It's pretty cool looking. I like that, that Dino. And I like that art too. Especially that reverse hollow look. Oh, hey. Well, it's still a uh, reverse hollow dark rye. Looks very good. Definitely uh, digging it. I'm digging it. How about you? All right. I know. I am uh, trying to uh, pull the cards out a little differently, as well as, you know, sorting them a little more appropriate. And I can catch a glimpse. I don't know if you guys can see that, too. But there is something this time. That's not just a. Reverse hollow rare. And whew, 
nice. Slow bro V. Look at that guy. He is angry. That is an angry little slow bro there. Very nice. Two ultra rares. We're about a little more than halfway through the first half. So we're, we're about a quarter of the way through. You know what? Here, have another code. So, uh, out of the cards, you know, not named Charizard. Um, how about you guys? What, how are you, are you guys excited for any particular card? Maybe this uh, awesome little Panseer with a really cool art. I mean, I know it's a common, but that is still really, really cool art. Yeah, Escavalier. Escavalier. I mean, I, I would say you're excited to, you know, build the deck for the next tournament, but there is no telling when next tournament is going to be. Because I know, at least for the rest of the year, um, Pokemon Play has canceled, you know, all official events. But, you know, I guess there could very well be you know, some unofficial stuff going on in your area. I know there are some in mine. It's uh, interesting to see people between shower curtains and we're all wearing masks and, you know, being careful not to touch each other's cards and stuff. It, it, it's, it's a crazy world we live in, guys. Like, it really is. It is definitely a crazy world we live in. Right. Oh, I think we got something in this one too. Struggle gloves. All right. Let's see what we got here. Ooh, look at that. Pokemon Breeders Nurturing for the Reverse Hollow Uncommon. Very nice. And behind of that, we have a Vika Volt V. Very nice. That is a gorgeous secret rare right there. Very, very nice. That is definitely a pretty, pretty little card there. Man, that is uh, some decent pulls and still not even at the halfway point of the box. It feels like it's taking forever because I can't open these packs. Keep that one. We'll keep that one. You may have noticed that, uh, you know, my sorting is a little different than usual. Um, I'm trying to be more conscious of, you know, your your commons and your uncommons and your uh, your rares. Ah, my word. They use some kind of crazy glue on that, man. But it, it's just going to make it easier in the long run, which is, you know, eventually you're going to have to go through and resort. But at least I won't have to worry about sorting by rarity. And I can just focus on energy type. Ooh, a Muvi. Very nice. That one snuck up on me. I like how the hollow is with the eyes there. Look at that. It's just like glistening in those blue eyes on that Mew V. Very nice. Not 100% value on all these cards. Um, I do have somewhat of a cheat sheet up. But I can't really see it from where I am sitting. Maybe uh, at the halfway point we can I take a lean over, take a peek at it. And I am very, very pleased. Look at this Simapore there. What a ham. Just chilling on the rock, 
doing his thing. Ooh, a little Drekovich. Hollow rare. Very nice. And, uh, probably should have, uh, increased the, uh, the view. I um, said cheat, cheat when I tried to sneakily lean over there. Ooh, look at that heat energy there. Yeah, I am really, really digging the art. I like it a lot. I know I keep saying that, but it is very, very true. Okay. Well, uh, if you're curious, that uh, Vika Volt full art there, it's, it's about a $10 card. Um, uh, TCG player value. So if you were curious, I know the uh, the uh, Eternatus V Max card is uh, worth a decent penny. I know there's some some other ones out there. Yeah, that did dead a love it in that reverse hollow. Very nice. And a Lugia. All right, we are past the halfway point. So far, we're sitting at four very, very nice cards. Ah, uh, yeah, here's another code. There's another code. At least that way, you know, if, if you can't get your hands on any Darkness of Blaze for a while, you can at least, you know, have some codes to jump on Pokemon TCG online and uh, experience a little there. If I could help, I am glad to do it. All I could say is, uh, you know, if you're taking these codes, do the right thing and you know, hit, hit that subscribe button. Scratch your back, scratch my back, you know, you know. Linwood Tangle. Interesting looking trainer there. Kind of want to pick it back up and read it. Yeah, the Yellhorn. Both active Pokemon are now confused. Ooh, and a Kangaskhan Hollow Rare. Very nice. Let's see. Grimwood Tangle. Once during each player's turn, after that player flips any coins for an attack, they may ignore all reserves of those coin flips and begin flipping those coins again. That's pretty, pretty interesting. So if you've got like a, a double, double damage type card based on a certain coin flip that could definitely uh, make you very nasty if you uh, activated that trainer I think there's something behind this little torchic here and nothing I was very wrong I thought I saw the slight glimmer of a black border guess what I saw was nothing. Nothing but a Vanillix. And... Oh, that Teddy Ursa. I'm sure I have passed by multiple of them. Little wishy-washy the Cuvent. Ooh, yeah, Toxtricity. Reverse Hollow. Very nice. And the Gothiel. What do you guys think of the art? You guys, you guys liking it yourselves? I like it. I like it a lot. I know. I know. I, I just I keep saying it, but I can't help it. And it's like that's always been like the the one place when it comes to you know Pokemon trading cards that. 
was never really big fan of was the art, but the art in Darkness of Blaze so far is I like it. There you go. Here's another code for you. See, I'm not keeping all of them for myself. Try not to be greedy. Look at that adorable Dedenne. Love it. Bird Keeper. And little Skitty. And behind this centret, oh, is an Arcazult. Hollow rare. We're getting a lot of hollow rares, though. Only five. Felt like it was a lot more than that. I guess that's a that's about on par with average. Yeah, I'll keep that one. I'm a bird keeper. So yeah, um, those of you local to the future location of the Mages Archive. Um, as you know, the store is coming very soon, but, uh, before I get to that, there is a black border here behind this melodic, a Houndoom V, not too shabby, that's a pretty cool looking guy there, I can dig it, Houndoom. But yeah, um, again, barring any crazy, unforeseen craziness, um, we can expect the doors to be open in just a, maybe two more weeks. Um, I should be able to start my portion of getting the space ready this weekend I hope um, I intend to you know I'll, I'll do a little spicy reveal of uh, the soon to be space for the store and play area and whatnot I'm really excited that freaking Simapore, man. That guy. What a ham. But, uh, I, I, I can't wait to get in there. I, uh, did a bunch of looking around. Blowing, billowing. I always said blowing. Billowing smoke reverse hollow. But, uh, decided that I am actually going to build my own counters. Um, just after looking at all of the uh, display counters and stuff. It was just astronomical what they want for cheap particle board. Essentially, it's, you know, that kind of Walmart-type furniture that is not going to last. Look at that pin pour. I think I've seen it, but I don't know. Oh, really, really like that. Hydrogen reverse hollow rare there. That is quite gorgeous. So it was just, you know, for that kind of money, I can build, use my carpentry skills to make something actually nice. That's going to last. So, and, and it really won't even take that long. It's not like it's going to be some crazy, you know, oh, it's going to delay the opening. By months, no, no. It, it, the amount of time it'll take me to build it, stain it, put some nice polyurethane on it. Ooh, Galizapod, hollow rare. I will. Yeah, it, it's it's not gonna delay anything, and it's gonna look so much nicer. There you go. You guys can have that code too. I know I said I was gonna keep about half, but I guess I'm I'm kind of. Still giving away most, but that's fine. That is fine. That purr lion. Winking at you. Winking kitty. Ooh, hippo down. 
Talon Flame. That's pretty cool looking rare. All right, so we are down to our last six packs. We've only got five Ultra and Secret Rare cards. Hopefully, um, we can get at least a VMAX. I would really like the pool one. Really, really would. But yeah, if you guys have gotten your hands on some early Darkness of Blaze, I'd love to hear. Um, you know, what you guys pulled. You know, if, hey, if you got that awesome new Charizard V Max, I'd love to see some pictures. You know, go ahead and tweet at me. I really, really love to see it. Yeah, I mean, even if, even, even if you just, you know, you got some cool cards that you want to share, please, you know, tweet at me, Instagram me, Facebook me. I want to see them. Really want to. Yeah, awesome. I was really digging that Bundle Bee art. I'm glad it showed up in Reverse Hollow there. I like it a lot. I really want to see what you guys got. I really do. Especially, especially if you got it from us. Definitely, definitely want to see it. Oh, I think we've got something coming up here, folks. After more lull, will we be lolling? Sizor V Max. There we go. Finally got ourselves a nice little V Max there. Sizor in his monstrous V Max glory. Very, very nice. Really, really was hoping. To get at least one V Max. I was happy that we got the the Vigavolt Secret Rare, but definitely, definitely wanted V Max. Here we got one, as requested. The box came through for us. Yeah, um, I don't know if you guys know uh, or have noticed, but it, if you haven't um, pre-ordered any, whether it's from us, ooh, hello there, Secret Rare Capture Energy. I was not expecting you in the least. Very nice. Very, very nice. Not too bad. That is gorgeous. I mean, just that was like just two more packs to go, and like just the last couple packs there have really, really spiced it up. Here, take another code. That is very nice. But yeah, uh, regardless, um, if you want an elite trainer box, again, whether you get it from us or anywhere else. Um, there may be a bit of a shortage of them. So I recommend if you don't find somebody with them in stock online, um, probably hit up your local um, game stores. And if they're sold out, then hit up your big box stores. Um, yeah, I think your best bet will probably end up being your big box stores if you want one. Um, I know my distributors, both of them, had their um, amounts cut like drastically. I know my allocations were reduced quite a bit. I was supposed to get 12 and I only got 6. So just to kind of give you an idea. So, But again, I really hope you guys enjoy the video. Um, but again, with the, the, the trainer boxes, don't, don't think that you're never going to get one and they're going to be gone forever. More will come, but if you're wanting one sooner than later without having to pay, you know, uh, a, a premium from somewhere, 
a reseller, you know, trying to take advantage of the situation, um, definitely make sure you get yours tomorrow, um, as early as possible. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, re really, really, really enjoyed this box opening. There's a lot of good stuff here. And uh, until next time, take it easy.